working on the Dodge Cummins today. Next week she should hit about 300,000. I got a 2000 Dodge Ram 2500. 5.9 liter 24 valve Cummins. My uh, radiator reservoir was leaking. So let's take a look. See how we're going to get her out of there and uh, how everything's going to work. Here she is. 2000 Dodge Ram 24 valve Cummins. 2500. Today I got to do the reservoir. <coughs> got the new one right here. It was leaking on me a couple days ago. <coughs> put that fucker right there. So now I got to get in there. I just put a new radiator in. New water pump. New belt. Hold on a minute here. Yeah, I put a new new water pump down here. If you can see that. Brand new. It was like 50 bucks at AutoZone. New belt. It was like 25 at AutoZone. I mean, uh, uh, O'Reilly's, both O'Reilly's. Radiator was from AutoZone, had a lifetime warranty. I just put one in two years ago, it was leaking. So I just replaced it all a couple days ago. A new radiator, new belt, new water pump. Pretty easy water pump, two bolts and a seal. And this thing just pops out with a clip, it's pretty easy. See the new one looks way better. Got it at the junkyard, US Auto. So uh, let's try to get her out of here real quick. Let me grab my gloves. She's clean, she's not bad. A little crack on the dash, you know, all Dodges get that. Put these dirt bike gloves on real quick. That's all I got. Let's see if we can pop this fucker off. <clears throat> got two new batteries on her from last year. I think a new alternator came with it had the truck for about three years this is my method of getting her off I just get down here and grab her ass and pop her hopefully she pops uh -oh. listen I didn't want to happen I got my fucking I got my uh, shroud zip tied in there because the bolt stripped out on me that's what you get for messing around with 20 year old truck broke that one damn now I gotta zip tie that back up <laughs> it's alright <clears throat> those zip ties don't hurt nothing oh my god that fucker's on there one second here YouTube Sorry about that, we're back now. Everybody keeps calling me. Let me find a flathead here in my tool bag. Let's see if I can put a little flatty in here. I knew I had one. There we go. I got the long one if I need it. should do let's see if Betsy's gonna pop for us here <clears throat> we can fill her up and she shouldn't leak let's see if I can pop this clip down here if I can get to it so we got this one right here as you can see <clears throat> we got this clip and we got one at the bottom as you can see right here we got pop them fuckers that's the bitch oh, fuck. 
All right, there goes the cat. Don't grab hold of that. Didn't even mean to. I'm about to ready to break this fucker. <clears throat> Get this fucking there a little bit. Pop her up. There we go. Look at that. Perfect. Let me unplug her here. There we go. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at the difference. 2000 a fucking. I think this was off a of 2001 gasser. You can tell this one's off the diesel. <laughs> horrible so let's pop this fucker on real quick maybe wipe her down real fast maybe take that take that clip off her because the clip looks a little better maybe the hose too it won't stay there betsy there we go you grab a rag Yeah, my dirt bike helmet. <clears throat> All the vids I've been doing, it's a nice helmet. Pretty badass. Got all my shit. See, I gotta clean this. This is from when I was doing all my, my coolant, putting the coolant in a new radiator. Uh, gotta throw some stuff out here. Don't wanna lose that, I need that for work. <clears throat> so rag should do it. She's looking down here real quick. Hell yeah, greasy. Greasier than a motherfucker. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> I'm putting that one back on. You gotta live in an apartment and I did all this in the apartment at my buddy's house in the trailer park. I do what you gotta do. Look at that. The clip just broke. You know, that's garbage. Let me try to get some players real quick. <clears throat> ah, these will work. Breaking off, rustier than fuck. This thing's still on there. There we go. Take this fucker off, there we go. Hose for a rainy day. Uh, uh, this one should come right off nicely. Hopefully, I don't break it. There we go. That hose is off right there. Put this hose on. Got the old bus breaking down out here. Good old diesel. Probably, uh, probably uh, industrial Cummins in this one. Probably the same motor as mine, but industrial. You can smell it. Smell that fucking, that diesel. It 
There we go. She's locked down. Should be good. Now we just throw her in there. Look at that. Cummins gonna like that. No more leaking, huh? No more cheating. on there look at that nice now to get some zip ties and zip tie her down pretty easy you just pop these two clips off pull up on it if this was attached you could just pull up on the whole bottle and it'll pop out then you just pop it back in and you're all good to go hook the wire up here check my coolant if i need to be topped off she's all right yep all you gotta do, replacing the reservoir and your 2000 Dodge Ram 2500 from 15, from 1500, 2500, and 3500 are all the same from 98 to 2001. So you shouldn't have a problem. Alright, guys, see you in the next one.